hope you're all well. Recently, I did a video uh, on the N64 playing Doom with the steering wheel. It actually played really, really well. You know, I was surprised how well that actually played. Then I used the steering wheel to go through some other games and see what worked and what didn't. And the majority of the games worked really well. I did another video playing Smash Brothers, which worked just. You know what I mean? It wasn't very easy to play. You had to, there was the, the directions and everything else you had to do and put in different, just, it was awkward. It was playable, but awkward. But that's got me thinking, what other systems have I got? What other odd controllers have I got that I can play games with that, that we're not meant for? And I absolutely love the GameCube. You know what I mean? That, that's just something I collect for quite a bit. A lot of nostalgia for it. So I thought I'd try there. The only odd controller I've got for it, though, apart from arcade sticks and things like that, which sort of probably easier to play with, is this. The Donkey Kong Bongos. So I went through my collection, I hooked this up, and I tried to see if I could find a game or games that I could play with the bongos. But I came into the same problem with most of the games. If you don't know the bongos, it's not at the top, it's actually there's buttons here and there's buttons here and there's a microphone in the middle which you clap which does something else in the game. And you've got start and select. That's it. So there's only four buttons. I tried, first of all, Mario Kart. And I can go left and right. No, sorry. I can go forward and backwards. And I could fire weapons. But I cannot go left and right. This does not have left and right directions on it. And it is a shame because, you know, it... it It'd be nice to mod it so we could steer it like this and then all such a... But that isn't it. That isn't how it works. I've also found out as well that the microphone in the middle, unless it's on the Donkey Kong game, does nothing. So we're down to four buttons. That's all we've got to play with. And start and select. But, you know, that's, that's just for clicking on things. So going through the collection and everything else, I was really struggling. I to give up. And then I found this. Soul Calibur 2. And what I found with this is I can do attacks with this, and clearly you're only going left and right, but the attacks make you go forward, you know? So it's playable. So why not? Let's go and play with the Bongos and Soul Calibur, and let's just see how we get on. Because I had a quick play last night, and I think, think... It's going to work. Right, here we are. The bongos are set up. Uh, again, I've tried to set it up so that you can see the bongos and the TV screen at the same time. It's quite difficult to get them both in shot. Um, I've changed over. I'm no longer on the, um, the Boombox CRT. I've actually got the Philips Discover out, the one that's got the, uh, the helmet. It's easy to put it up. It looks really nice in the corner, but... Right. As I said with this, you do struggle with going uh, left and right. There's just no left and right controls on this whatsoever. So to begin with, just to select, I am going to be going through with this. Uh, just to pick my character, really. Because otherwise, you can play you play arcade and then you can only pick the one character. Um, I'm going to go with a favourite of mine. Maxi. Oh, what have I done there? Nope, press the wrong button. Oh, I thought it'd be the. Oh, hang on. Before this starts, quickly put my bongos in. Should have done this before I selected him. There we are. Right, so now, you can see, I'm going to press the start button. And that starts me off. So, this button here, we do get. I'm just going to go for it quickly to begin with. Uh, you've got a block here as well, and uh, now you can actually do grabs. Knockout. Uh, Maxie's definitely the character I always go to. So, what I'm going to do now is I'm just going to play for a bit until I die. And normally, when I played this yesterday, because I can't step forward and towards them or sidestep, I really do struggle. 
with the characters who've got like a, quite a long reach. So sometimes I'll go a bit quiet because I'm actually thinking. <laughs> And a perfect, then again, it is the first level, so. But it's the first level and I'm playing with the bongo, so I'll take that, I'll take the perfect. So yeah, let's, let's just play through for a bit until I die. Right, let's just hope we don't get, um, is it the rock or whatever it is, rock first, because he's the one I really struggle with. I can beat him. Skip. Right, let's go for it. Try not to do the same move over and over again. It's, it's difficult because there are actual combinations. You can do like these buttons or these buttons or three buttons. And you combine them with a move you've already done. So you can do different moves. Oh, I can sidestep. I've just seen that. So, yeah, he must have like an actual... Oh, you bastard. Oh, don't want to swear on my videos. <laughs> Happens sometimes when you're playing a fighting game. <laughs> I won't rage quit and throw this at the screen, I promise. Right. Oh, she's got a long range attack. Mate Pod always plays with Ivy's. The same moves over and over again. Right, we can do this. get closer to her. I'll go for a grab. Got her. Long range attack. That's what I've got to worry about. Oh, knew she was powering that up, but I couldn't do nothing about it. And now I can do power up moves. Got her. <laughs> Definitely not the most practical way to play this game, but. Uh, it's playable. Definitely it's playable. You, you don't get the entire range of um, moves. It's like trying to play with a handicap, really. Um, I think she's quite close range. Actually, another character I really like playing with. Oh, I thought I blocked that. Go for it. I was going to go for a grab then, and she's just not someone you want to go grab for if you miss. She punishes you. Oh. Sorry, I think I'm two ended then. I held it up and missed, she blocked it all. Got her. How far can we get? How far can we get? Oh, do you know what? I've got two bongos as well, and I'm definitely going to take these around for a game night with Pod and hook up both of them and actually play two player with this. Because I think it would just be highly amusing, especially because he knows all the actual... Oh, Volo. Oh, hate this character. There's nothing I could do about that because I couldn't move in. No, don't go for grab. Don't go for grab. Oh. Why did you go for a grab? <laughs> Sometimes you're playing a fighting game and you get stuck into a loop and it's not working, but you keep doing it anyway. 
come on, we can beat him. Oh, ring out, come on. Got him. Oh, missed. Got him. <laughs> See, you really, really missed the sidestep. I, when I play these fighting games, I use sidestep quite a lot. As my mates will say, I use the sidestep more than I block. <laughs> I very rarely block. Really should learn to do that now. Oh, that wasn't going for a grab. Stop it. <laughs> Got him. No, I'm dead on this one. Oh, do you know what? I'm going to try one more because he's bugging me and I want to beat him. I can do it. Yeah, I'm going to regret playing it. When you get these characters that are sort of not quite your normal move set, you, you struggle. Got him. Right. I did say I was going to go. It's classic gamer, isn't it? One more. One more. <laughs> not close enough. Stay away from you from that. Yes, beat him. It's quite close that one as well. I tell you what, the rubber on this is really starting to hurt the tips of my fingers as I'm pressing it. It is a shame that this microphone here in the middle isn't working because can you imagine playing the game and halfway through I'm clapping like this to try and do a move. I have tried, I have tried. I think I'm reaching my, my liver, limit now. Can't, can't go down. He's blocking everything high because I can't duck down. Definitely if I die on this one, I'm done. Promise. <laughs> Oh, nice one. I think I found a different combination of buttons. Make sure my bongos are still inside in the shops. Yeah. Blocking every single one. Oh, <laughs> it's like step round me. But there we go. The bongos, Donkey Kong bongos, playing Soul Calibur 2 on the GameCube. Is it possible? Yes. Is it enjoyable? Yes. It really is enjoyable. I've enjoyed... Um, playing this uh, I've enjoyed it I, I'll probably go through and see if there's any more that I could um, any more games that I could play if you've got some bongos and you've got this game give it a go you know let me know what you think 
I really think it's it's been very fun. It has definitely has been fun. If anyone knows how to mod these things so that you can actually make them go left or right or even add some extra buttons in, please let me know because I'd love to do that. Because if, if you just had it left and right, so like a button here and a button there to go left and right as well as everything else, you could play so many games with this. Right, enough of me um, getting my ass kicked on Soul Calibur. And I've got an excuse because I'm playing with bongos. I will catch you all again next time. And uh, again, thanks for watching. Bye.